it has been ridiculously hot today. I think we were just shy of 40 degrees. So we did a bit this morning and we went for a swim and then that was pretty much the rest of the afternoon. But we're now gonna crack on with the table. So the plan here is we've got a sheet of pine, not this sheet, it's slightly wider, but it's this 600 mil wide, um, 18 mil pine laminate sheeting from Bunnings. And the plan is to have it on locking drawer slide. So it'll slide in under there and lock out and then we'll have it come out a meter. So that's gonna be our table. I think we're going 480-ish wide. This is once again, something I've designed in SketchUp, but we might tweak it a little bit as we go. So this is our tabletop. Uh, the piece that we've got is 1800 by 600. So we're gonna measure it, cut it and sand it and assemble it. For anyone who watched the mountain bike tray build, we're kind of doing the same thing, except this will be the other way around. And just at the moment, I've just got the draw slides out and I'm just holding them in position. So I've got these supports that'll go on and that's just basically to thicken up the side of the table so that these have got something to screw into. And I'm just laying these out. And I'm just working out where the screw holes are for the draw slide so that when we screw down through our support timber, we don't end up with screws in spots where we're trying to screw through the draw slide. Been a bit of a break since we built the table, but we're now gonna move on to installing it under the bed. So for that, I've got these one meter long drawer slides. They're the locking type, so it'll lock in place and won't come out. And it'll also lock when it's out and stay out when we want it out. So we're gonna start off by attaching the table to the drawer slides. Then I think we'll attach the slide to the supporting rails that we're gonna screw down from the top of the bed. And then we'll hold it in place and screw it down. We cut the supporting rails down for this yesterday. Brooke gave them a lick of paint and now we're gonna attach them to the drawer slides before we mount it. So for these, I've left the thickness of the cladding, which is about 13 mil, because on the front of it, we're gonna clad the front and it'll just be sitting in the wall on the front face of the bed here. So I've just made enough room for that. So let's attach the rails and position this and then screw it into place. <laughs> How is it? Pretty good. We just put a couple of extra screws in there to support it. But yeah, pretty happy with that. I think it's a good sized table. The view is obviously not the best. But that, that view is better. That view, I'll just be like, <laughs> um, I have a kink neck by the end of it, but that's all right. Well, that view, yeah, that's pretty good. We just realized that this kind of doubles as like a standing desk, it's an unplanned feature, but 
you know, if we don't want to be sitting the whole time, we can do a bit of standing up. And then also, pull it out the whole way. Also, it's kind of like some extra bench space. You know, this is like your kitchen. You can get stuff out the fridge. You know, a couple bananas, whatever else. And then you like, come over to here, chop, chop, chop. Some winds, some unplanned winds. Well, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.